Can grit really be explained through neuroscience? Sigmund Freud stressed the significance of grief work in 1917 to recoup the emotional energy invested in the deceased. This perception of the psyche as a conduit for subliminal life energies lasted until recently. Psychologists and neurobiologists began to investigate the nature of resilience, which means fast returning to normal functioning comparable to how a steel beam bends under stress. However, our biology is more complicated than this comparison suggests. Resilience begins at a primordial level when the hypothalamus releases stress hormones like cortisol, which can damage hippocampal and amygdala brain cells. When confronted with danger, the brain launches a chemical cascade that results in response to defend or flee. Certain substances, on the other hand, can decrease this reaction, improving stress resilience. The hypothalamus secretes corticotropin releasing hormone, which causes the pituitary gland and adrenals to secrete adenocorticotropin hormone and cortisol. Overuse can have long-term consequences. Scientists have discovered that some protective biochemicals such as DHEA and neuropeptide Y assist individuals in more easily switching off stress hormones. These compounds and defensive biochemicals have been shown to lessen anxiety in resilient people. Researchers at the Yale University affiliated VA hospital discovered in 2000 that troops with greater blood levels of neuropeptide Y performed better during simulated interrogations and were less likely to develop post-traumatic stress disorder. Delta Force B is a protein scientists found that protects mice and humans from stress caused by being alone or being threatened by aggressive mice. This protein is a molecular switch activating genes and driving protein synthesis. It is lacking in depressed people postmortems brain tissue. A medication that decreases Delta Force B levels may protect against depression and increase resilience. It will however be some time before an energy drink containing resilience powder becomes reality.